look where we are, everybody. Texas Chain Asker, the original movie, gas station. where the coke machine was at. Oh yeah. Yeah, where uh, Sally and Pam were trying to get a coke out of there. They mm -hmm. were having a hard time getting it. Here's the door here. Like, First one she tried to get into and she couldn't. Yeah. I thought too, and I remember she tried this one and she couldn't get in, and she went down to that one and got in that one. Well, I do know this is the door where uh, Jen Cedal, who was the cook, yeah, was drink swear, mm -hmm. got to uh, turn off the lights. Yes, yeah, that's where the barbecue was and all that good stuff. Yeah. Store. So, and yep. This is where, right over here, where, where they had the, the gas pulled up. Yeah. And then you have this little guy over here washing their windows. Mm-hmm. And while our uh, victims are talking to uh, Drayton Sawyer about, you know, if they have any gas. Yeah. Yeah, right there where that thing is at. The fence. <laughs> Yep. Of course, it's something you probably, we never saw. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure Spider. I'm not sure if this was if it was there originally or if this was added later. I don't know. Uh, Careful. <laughs> well, you know, if there's, a, if there's a chainsaw wheeling maniac around, <laughs> you'll be the first to know. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. It was the other way around, though. Yep. Probably right over here. Over where this probably dead grass is on. Long dead grass. Uh huh. Where, where she ran. Yeah, where Leatherface is catching up with her. Mm hmm. And then she tries to get into the grass. box over there. Nice. I wonder where all those two boxes came from. I don't know. I'm really not sure if this will ever be open again. I don't either. Oh, I hope not. Because this is like history right here. Yeah, I know. You know? We're standing where they shot Yep. So true. Yes. But this is my second time being here. My third, I think. I think it's third. Third, maybe fourth, but. I think it's third. Yeah. But, but it's a good place, you know? Definitely yep. if you're a Texas Chainsaw Massacre fan. If you Am I not Yeah, I'm reporting. Okay. I didn't, see the, I didn't see the red light. Anyway, if you're a Texas Chainsaw Massacre fan, if you happen to live near Bastrop, Definitely get it, check it out. Mm -hmm. There's really nobody here. No. Nope. You know, nobody, you know, inside or anything like that. So it's yep. it's really hard to tell if, if if it's owned by anybody. I'm sure somebody owns it. Yeah. You know, just to keep it around. But, but 
They should really, you know, fix the place up. They should. At least, you know, you make it into like a... Haunted house. That'd be cool. A haunted house or like, like <laughs> a little museum for Texas Chainsaw. That'd be cool. Memorabilia from probably all the movies. Mm-hmm. That'd be cool. It'd be really cool if we, you know, if we went to the original house. Yeah, I know. You know. The restaurant. <laughs> yes, but that'll be another time. Yeah. Maybe sometime in the summer. Mm-hmm. Mm. Well, I'll talk to you guys.